Hi, this is Justice with Tablet Pro. I'm going to be talking about using a Switch controller, Joy-Cons, as an Xbox One controller, a single Xbox One controller on your PC. Now, this used to be possible with a couple other different methods, uh, like XJoy and ViGem. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that correctly. And I haven't been able to figure out how to do that, and so I researched a new solution and found one that I absolutely love. Now, these guys have a very comfortable grip, a very Xbox, a very Xbox-like feel. They're very ergonomic. And they have these extra buttons on the back that you can map really easily with this button here. You push this and then you tap whatever or hold whatever button it is you want it to behave as, and then it maps it. Super easy. You can do it right in the middle of a game and it's awesome They charge with USB-C. I'll put a link to these in the description. Kind of Xbox Elite type feeling super useful. I like these ones a lot. I had to answer the question, how do I get this to work on Windows 11? I have a Surface Laptop Studio and uh, I play games with my uh, Laptop Studio in tablet mode on a swinging arm in front of my bed. And I wanted to be able to lay down on my back. This is really comfortable. I can put my arms to the side. Um, so it's, it's just easier on my wrists. And for a lot of different reasons, it's optimal really cool. So I was able to get this going and I'm going to share that with you right now. If you use a Windows tablet device, you like Joy-Cons gaming, or you use a stylus with the touch screen, this is a great channel for you. So please subscribe right now. All right. So this program right here is, uh, I, I say rewazzed, but I, I don't think that's how you're supposed to pronounce it. Uh, read WASD, um, like the gaming controls on your keyboard. Uh, these we're going to turn on. I'm just going to press these. You can change the color. You can change the rumble amount. These have gyro. They're super cool. Now you'll notice that, that uh, Re Wazd did a really good job of picking up my controller without me having to do anything. So I'm not remapping it. It doesn't take long to pair. It pairs within a couple seconds of turning it on. It keeps the connection. Um, yeah, and these were 50 bucks on Amazon and easily worth it. I will put the link in the description. I have a couple licenses to re WASD. If you'd like them in the comment section, put the game you want to play most with this setup. And I will pick two lucky winners. Okay. So now these plus this little gem, which is super powerful. And by the way, I'm going to do a little series here because what I've done is I've used these for gaming. And uh, I'm also, I added a switch on here. So when I press um, this button right here, what will happen is these will turn into a mouse with keyboard shortcuts. And so I've been editing video laying flat on my back, super, super comfortable. I need a straw that will let me drink laying down and then I will be set. <laughs> but, uh, and I'll, I'll do a video explaining my setup here more, um, more info on my setup and a video coming soon. Uh, so these guys are, are awesome and I can just lay in bed and play games or edit video or control my computer. I have this button right here set up to Cortana which means I can go inside of a lot of different programs, left and right click, and I can um, just input text and do all sorts of cool things. More on that to come. All right, so here, in order to get this set up, you need to go into Windows settings. We're gonna go to Bluetooth, uh, devices. We're going to add device. And all you're going to do on these guys is you're going to hold this button right here until it's flashing. You'll click here on Bluetooth and you'll see the devices. You'll see the devices pop up as Joy-Con left and Joy-Con right. Uh, there's a million tutorials on that one. It's very, very easy to do. If you struggle with it, put it in the comment section or watch another video. Okay, so you're going to see those two over here separately, what you're going to do is you're going to click on this 
group button, you're going to find from the drop down uh, both of these, and this they both should show up here in the drop down, and then you're going to save it as a group. All right, if I click apply, it will apply. Now here, when you have this already set up, you can click on this button and choose virtual Xbox One. I'm not sure what the difference between Xbox 360 and Xbox One is, but I chose Xbox One and it's awesome. These do not have exactly the same controls as an Xbox One controller, the same settings. So you you can fiddle with uh, the acceleration, you can fiddle with the dead zones and all that type of stuff. That is not what this video is. So. Uh, for right now, if you want to get this going, this is the easiest way to do it. Watch my second video on re WASD uh, to find out how to create a shift profile right here with mouse controls on it. Now I'll go into more details and how I have this set up, and I will also share my profile with you so you can build on it instead of having to do everything from scratch. All right, that's it for the basic setup for a Joy-Con to Xbox controller, joined Xbox controller, single Xbox controller, two Joy-Cons to one Xbox controller video. If you have questions, put it in the comment section. If you want to know how this works, um, well, actually, let's do this real quickly. Let's open up a little game. I've been playing Tunic, and Tunic is really cool. Uh, it's like old school Zelda um, on Nintendo with great graphics. You have to do a lot of exploring. It's really cool. And it's in Xbox Game Pass. Uh, so you can play it for free if you've already got that. Right, so you guys get the idea super fun game works really really well um the rumble's a little bit spazzy here and you can turn it off by pressing t and pressing down uh t and pressing down on the joystick on both of them you can turn the rumble down or up to full strength it's a little spazzy in this game but it works correctly in other things so um I'm not sure exactly what the deal is with that, but minor issue. All right, that's it. Check the description for links.